What's going on everybody? Welcome back to the channel. Today I'm going to do uh, a tutorial video that was kind of uh, spur of the moment. Uh, Benzo released a video showing how to uh, install sirens into your game. And in that video he had made a comment about fire truck sirens. I actually know how to change the fire truck sirens aside from your police and ambulance. Uh, so today I'm going to show you how to do that. Um, I told uh, Benzo he wanted to know how to do it, so I was like, well, I'll make a video of it and I'll show everybody how to do it. Um, it can be done with ELS. You can change the police, the uh, police, police four. Uh, you can change quite a few of them, actually. Um, the only drawback to this is that you only get one air horn. Um, well, two if you count the fire truck. There's a fire truck air horn and then a regular air horn. So, say for instance, you want in your police vehicles to run the LAPD siren, and you want your police four car to run the CHP siren, you only have one air horn. So, you kind of got to pick which one it is. Now, me personally, I can't stand the CHP siren. However, their air horn is phenomenal. So, that's the one that I would choose. But if you want to use a smart siren air horn, that's what you can use. But today, I'll show you how to uh, do all that and go a little more in depth on everything and show you and leave some of the stuff in the description for you to pay attention to uh, right here is a uh, thing that I have this is let's let's not get into this part yet let's let's not get into that yet let's get into the sirens because this is what really uh, gets into it and this is before you even get into the open IV part um, the one that Benzo did uh, is pretty much a drag and drop. Um, for some of this, you have to change names and stuff, uh, so it's going to be a little different. So some of the processes uh, are going to be a little bit different um, because for this, like I said, you have to change names. Um, these right here, this resident vehicle siren quick, siren whale, siren quick two, two, three, three, fire truck, and all this, that all has to be renamed based on the siren that you want to use and where you're going to be putting it um in the game um so right now my current siren in the game is the master combi uh, which is this one right here uh, i will play that uh, let's just do the whale so that you can hear it um right here if that uh killed your ears i apologize um that doesn't even sound like the one that's in my game i think that's the one that i didn't use um, so if you look in here, this is now the part in Benzo's video where he uh, exported um, export to open formats to its own file. Uh, that's exactly what this vehicles and this vehicles file uh, AWC file is right here. This is just the actual sirens that I break down. I actually have like several different sirens that I have where I have it that way. That way, no matter which siren I have, I already have a folder for it. I could just swap back and forth. But that's a topic for a different day so we were in the master com b folder and we were in the baxter's version all right so if we go into the vehicles folder this will show you every single basically every single sound that relates to vehicles in the game and there's a lot of them uh, air horn eqd this is the like i said this is the only air horn that you can get all right, so that one is for the Master Combi, and if that's loud, I apologize, but it's blowing my eardrums out as well. Um, and if we keep going down, you'll go down to, where did it go? Siren, PA, and they rename stuff. So if some of you guys haven't done this in a long time, these will be renamed, and I'll have all that in the description too. Siren, PA, 20A, whale, that is your main police uh, whale. <laughs> For the master combi or at least for what i have it for but you'll see here the siren quick oh one two three four and whale those are the ones that we're going to be changing here in a little bit for other ones as well as uh siren two well siren two is your main one but then you also have siren truck or siren fire truck and siren fire truck there's two of them here um it doesn't show you the i don't think it'll even if i do this here can i do that there we go all right so uh, quick 01 and quick and O and 01 quick and whale. Um, I'll show you what that is. All right, so the whale or the quick that I have is a power call, and the whale should be an electronic. Um, I can never remember the uh, the Q siren. All right, 
So that's killing my eardrums, but there it is. Um, and then also, you'll need to take note of one called Fire and Tr or Fire and my God, I can't talk today. Uh, Siren. There we go. Fire truck air horn or fire truck horn. This is the air horn for the fire truck. All right. So as you can see, I've got that in. Now, what I'm going to do today is I want to replace the um, the siren for police four. All right. Now, it doesn't really matter what car you put in police four because all of these changes are based on how you word a VCF or the uh, you know the VCF for a car. So, and I will show you mine real quick, which right now is just going to be blank. Well, it's not going to be blank. It's just going to be a generic, and that's how I'm going to show you. So if we go into the ELS and we go to Police 4, all right, and go down to right here is this is the most important part for any of this. All of this is the most important part. This is where all your changes will actually show in game and sound, okay? So right here it says Vehicle Horn Siren 1, Vehicle Horn Siren 2. That is your main siren and whale. And then you have police warning, which is your phaser. And then ambulance warning, which is just like an alternate that you can... It's it's actually, if you hit the f number four on your... Uh, oh, don't do that. Uh, number four on your keyboard, that gives you your fourth siren. And then your fifth siren is actually just a dual tone for the whale. Um, number six, which is what this one... Well, that's not what this is, but number six actually just allows you to go over and over again. Um, but this is where all the magic will happen, and I'll show you all that as we go because this is the one that we're going to change for police four and then we're also going to be changing uh the fire truck one because none of this as you can see this is all all factory this is a factory vcf how it came for the truck i'm gonna change all of it and show you exactly how to change it so that you can change uh the sirens however we have to change them in here first all right so you just go to lspdfr find you your favorite sirens oh and you're gonna need this muted slash dead air files for vehicle folder uh, you're gonna need this for two reasons cuz and like it says well I don't think this one says it but you cannot have over I think I think it's 16 megabytes or something like that I actually think it's a little less than I think it's 15 9 and some change um, so you have to get rid of uh, a lot of dead air you have to make a bunch of files inside your folder here dead air so some of these or a lot of these are actually blank you cannot just delete them you have to have the file in there and the name but it can be blank if you don't do this you will never have enough room for all these sirens you have to do this so and I will leave a link for this in the description if I remember I hope I do but if not it's muted dead airs it's on the, in the audio tab and you can download that one. Um, and this guy's, I should have had this set up before I even came in here, but in Charles Zinsky's, Charles Zinsky, however you say his name, uh, I believe he included some dead air space in his CHP siren as well. I could be wrong. Uh, I will look at that for you real quick. I believe he did as well. Yes. Inside his, he also gives you some other dead air ones. Um, and we'll talk about 04 and why those are dead air here in a minute. But um, So I recommend that you download both of these, especially if you're going to be using CHP anyway, because this is the best CHP siren out there, even though it's the sound of Satan and I can't stand it. It is the best one out there. Uh, but you need the dead air files, uh, except for the car cooling fan. Don't Don't make that one dead air. That sounds cool. Because that's what makes your car fan shut off when you shut your fan up, car. Never mind. Anyways. All right. So you'll need that one for the dead air and the siren if you want it. And then you're also going to need the other one that I showed you, the muted dead air. So you'll need both of those. Make sure you download those. All right. So as you can see, I've got it. Um, here's the dead air for that one. Because I have already downloaded it. And then you actually have a manual tone and some stuff like that. But... Um, yeah, let me see. Okay, all right. So the first thing you want to do is start changing your sirens out, all right? So I already have them here renamed. You can't use the air horn. 
because, like I said, remember, you only get one air horn for police, fire, or for police, any kind of police vehicle, and uh, ambulance. You only get one air horn. That's it, just one air horn. So you kind of have to pick the one you want. Uh, I'm not going to change this one simply because um, I like my Mastercom B air horn for now. Um, but if you wanted to use this one, you would literally just copy it and put it in there. Um, however, we are going to be using these. Now let me show you. Actually, let me do this because let me do something real quick. Let me re-download the CHP siren because these sirens come with different names and I'm going to show you how to uh, rename them and what to rename them to. Drag that to your desktop, bring that back over. Oh, there we go. Minimize that. All right, so we'll open this 7-zip. All right. All right, so now we have two of these. <laughs> uh, we'll forget the first one temporarily. All right, so open this up. And the main siren now. See, these are now this one is already named correctly if you want it for your normal police vehicles, one, two, and three. However, we don't want to use it for that. All right, we want to use it for the Quick Whale 01. And I'll show you on this here. All right, not this one, this one. All right, so right here it says the police bike siren is actually what the game uses for the highway patrol siren. However, we're which is also what we're going to use it for. That's why I put CHP in quotes here. Um, so Siren Whale 03 and Siren Quick Whale 03. That is your primary and secondary. Remember, the quick is secondary. <clears throat> Excuse me. Excuse me. All right, so what we need to do is we need to rename these because, as you can see, these are wrong. These are named for something else. So let's close this. All right, so the fastest way that you could do this is go down to Siren Quick Whale 3 and I will show you that that's not already what it shouldn't already be that anyway yeah see that is that is not the sound of Satan alright so what we're gonna do Siren Quick 03 now remember Siren Quick 03 is uh, the secondary siren so you click it hit F2 control C click off and then you go up here in Siren 2 you click it, F2, Control V. Now it's renamed. Now we're going to go down here to Siren Whale 03. Click it one time, highlight it, F2, Control Z, click off of it, PA20, PA20A Whale, F2, Control V. Now we've renamed our sirens. And then we can play them to ensure that these are the correct sirens. And that is obviously the sound of Satan. God, that is the sound of Satan. I hate that one. All right, so now that we've changed those sirens, now I recommend that you leave them in this folder or you put them in a folder, you know, so that you ha already have them named, but you don't have to. So highlight both, control C, come over here, click in the open area, control V, it's going to ask you to replace, just say yes, and you'll see it highlights them both. So now that they are both in here, there is sound of Satan 1 and number 2 we're going to stop that because the sound of Satan All right. so now that we've done that the siren is in here the only thing that's not in here is the air horn and again that's your preference on which air horn if you want to do an episode of LAPD and you use the smart siren you put that air horn in if you want to switch over and do an episode or play as CHP you just drop the air horn EQD in there and you're good to go because it will pull the same air horn out no matter which way you do it just make sure you're naming these correctly alright so let's go we can close this for now because we're gonna open up this alright alright so you see here the fire truck this is the sirens for the fire truck. And then, like we said, the fire truck horn, which is right here. All right, so let's go to fire truck. All right, so for the air horn, we want to use, what did we say? We said vehicles horn, fire truck warning. Now you have to copy all of this. And then control C. And I will put this in the description 
uh, so that you guys, or in a comment, depends on where I can find it, so that you guys can use it. So inside the quotes, you're going to want to replace that. Control V. Boom. Fire Vehicles, horns, fire truck, warning. So now we have the ho uh, horn. Um, all right. I'm going to come back over here, and then we got the fire truck primary. So we're just going to copy all of this. Control C, back to fire truck. And if you want to use these for manual tones, you can. This is if you're like holding, like if you're running with lights but no sirens, and you hold down the horn button, and then uh, hit the, or like if you're running with lights, no sirens, and you hit the, on a keyboard or on a controller, because that's what I use. Um, if you hold down the B key, you get your manual tone. Uh, and if you hold down the horn and hit the B key, you get the whale. That's what these first two are. These are manual tones. All right, so we want to go ahead and replace this manual tone with the new fire truck primary, control V. And we're also going to replace uh, siren tone one. That's the main siren for the fire truck with that one as well. All right, then we'll go into siren two. And you're really going to just do the same thing. Control C, and we're going to replace Siren 2. And Siren 2. And there we go. Now, Siren Tone 3, 4, Auxiliary, and Panic Mode. Um, I recommend you just set these to false. However, you don't have to. You can uh, do it however you want. So, um... Auxiliary siren. This is if you want to have a dual whale. That's what this one is. You can put a uh, warning in there again. Or if you'd like to have like the power call, which is uh, the quick O2, which is what I'm going to do. So we will put that in there. All right. So now what we're going to do is we're going to come down here, click on that, control C, because we want the word false. And you're going to turn everything else that's not one of these false uh, ambulance warning we don't need that false police warning we don't need that false all right so everything is in there the way we want it panic mode is false because we don't need that auxiliary siren and again auxiliary siren is your dual siren at least I think that's what that is uh, siren tone 4, false, because we don't need that. Siren tone 3 is also false. We won't be needing that. Siren tone 2 is the power call. Siren tone 1 is our uh, cue signal. And then man tone 1, man tone 2 are the manual tones for when you're running with lights but no siren, but you hold the button down. And then our horn. All right, so we will save that. Let's go to police 4. As you see, we're back to normal, but this is set to pull the original. This right here is the original ones. This is what you get for your main um, vehicles. Uh, a lot of these numbers have changed now, so don't worry about any of this stuff. Uh, Siren 2 is the same. Police warning is the same. Ambulance warning is the same. Stuff, so on and so forth. But they have changed uh, fire truck horn. It's actually called Fire Truck Horn now. Um, this one for the main siren, OXOD324, blah, 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 blah. It's actually that siren PA20A thing. And this is now called Air Horn EQD. I may actually go in and change those before I uh, upload it for you guys. I just know them off the top of my head, uh, but I'll change them for you guys. All right, so for CHP, we did, um, you're basically going to do the exact same thing, all right? Um, for the manual horn, we're going to leave that the same because that is the air horn. However, it's not going to be the CHP one. It's going to be the normal police car one. So we need to copy all this right here. Resident Vehicle Siren Whale 3. Control C. And which one was that? Okay. Whale. Okay. So Siren 1. Do not get rid of the quotes. Control V. All these Siren 1s. Control V. And if you want to use the auxiliary siren, uh, you can do that. Control V. Then you go back up here. Quick. 
O3, Control C. And then you will get rid of all the O2s. All right. And then again, you will double click on the word false, Control C, if you want. You don't have to. Um, panic mode, uh, you could, I wouldn't do it because it would sound funny if you're using, because this is going to be, this right here is the phaser for the, uh, for me, the Master Comm B. So whatever your main siren is, this is the, the phaser for it, so you don't want that. Mm, that's false, false, and false, so, false, false, and false, so. This is where most of the magic happens for it, is right in here. All right, so we will file, save. So we've changed police for and fire truck. We'll go into game here in a minute and show you uh, that it does work. But we've determined that they are in here inside this one. This is the sirens, so we will close these down. And we will open up the game and then we'll see if it works all right one thing i actually forgot to do until i got in the game and spawned the truck and was like wait a minute why did it not work um i forgot you got to put it in uh, open iv <laughs> uh, i got i got so wrapped up in talking that uh i forgot so um for me it's been like 10 minutes well not really i don't know how long it's been but um so we changed fire truck and police four so let's uh open up open iv and not forget that this time Um, so wherever you have your thing saved, you'll have vehicle sirens. Uh, you'll just go to your, um, uh, for me, I have it as saved here. Um, it's, it'll be mods, X64, audio, SFX, and then resident.rpf, and it's your vehicle's AWC. Um, all you have to do is drag it over and let it go. You'll see it's 15523, let it go. And it's 15666. As long as you are under 15, I think it says 16, but I'm pretty sure it's 159 and some change, you're good. So now the sirens are in there. And uh, now <laughs> I'll go back in the game and uh, show you that they work. All right, guys, we are back and we are in game now. And just to show you that they all work, uh, as you can see behind me here, I have a regular police vehicle, which for me is right now FBI, FBI 2, police 2, 1, 2, and 3, um, sheriff, sheriff 2, all that. Over here, we got the fire truck. And over here is uh, North Carolina State Highway Patrol. And I'm about to do everybody in North Carolina. Very upsettingly when I put the CHP siren on it. But <laughs> uh, that is the police 4 slot. Um, so first we'll hop in the, um, the regular police vehicle and show you the main siren, which is the master comm B. And, uh, so the manual tone, when you, uh, hit the B button on a controller. And the manual tone too, is if you push down on the horn button at the same time as holding that. If you let off the B button, you get that. That's what the manual tones are. But here's the main sirens. Master Comm B. Alright. So we'll hop out of that one. We'll hop over here to the fire truck now. Uh, this is Medic's fire truck. I love this thing. Uh, the skin is by uh, Rogue Thunder. But anyways, so manual tone. If you hold down the B key again. All right, and then if you hold down the air horn button, you get the power call. Manual tone, let off, you get the air horn. So main siren.
and then hit it and switch it to the um, number two, the power call. And if you want to run both at once, which I did it backwards, you should have put the other one first. So there is that one. So as you can see, it's working. And we'll run over here to Police 4. As you see, it says Unmarked Cruiser Emergency. That's Police 4. And here's where I piss off everybody in North Carolina. But again... But again, you only get one air horn. Now, I haven't experimented with the Quick Whale 01 and 02. There is maybe a possibility where you could rename one of those as a air horn and use it. I haven't tested that. Feel free to do so and let me know. Um, but here's the manual tones for that. Here's what's really fun. So, if you wanted, you can get them all going and just have music to your ears. So, we got the uh, CHP, the Sound of Satan right here. Master Com B right here. And the Federal Q Siren right here. So, you can do it, and you actually have two more of them. I mean... Let me shut this fire. This fire truck is annoying. I like it, but it's annoying. <laughs> I like it, but it's very loud and very annoying. Um, so, you can have multiple sirens. Um, we'll shut up the sound of Satan as well. And then we'll go ahead and turn this one off too. Um, so, you can have multiple sirens. Uh, you can actually have two more. Uh, we did... Um, so, you've got the... You've got the fire truck siren, you've got the regular police siren, and then you've got the siren whale and quick 01, 03. You can also do it with 01 and 02. You can do it with both of those. Uh, you can change both of those, and when we come out of game, I'll show you in that paper or in that diagram that I got uh, what you can change. But a lot of it depends on the siren that you put in and how much space you have. You'll have to dead air a bunch of uh, files in order to get a lot of sirens to work because these sirens, some of the ones that I have are extremely good quality sirens, so they're they're pretty high in their megabyte size. But that shows you right there that they do work in game. So we'll go out of game and we'll finish the video up there. All right. So as you saw in the game, they all worked. Um, and as I was also saying before we left the game that there were two more that you could also replace if you wanted. Um, uh, so Siren Whale 3, Elite, and that's just the one that I choose. You can use whichever one you want. Um, that's just the one that I used because it was already a police bike siren, which is uh, CHP in the game or SHP in the game, so that's why I used it. Uh, you could use either one of these for that. It doesn't matter. Um this as long as you are naming them correctly in here. This this right here is the biggest thing. You have to name these correctly or it won't work. Cuz this is this this VCF is telling the game where to pull the the audio from. Um so I always stuck with this one for CHP or Highway Patrol or whichever you want. Uh, you have an FBI siren, so you could change that so that your sheriff cars are different. 
Um, the reason they're named the way they are is because this is the siren that it actually is in-game if you have default sirens. So Siren Whale 3 and Siren Quick 03, those are default the bike sirens. Um, Quick Whale 4 or Siren Whale 04 and Siren Quick 04 are the Sheriff Granger sirens. So it's the original Sheriff 2 slot. However, uh, these don't work. Not that I've had. I, I've tried them three different times, um, and they don't work. Uh, FBI sirens. This is it's named that because of the default game. That's what these sirens are. Whale O2 and Quick O2. Those are FBI. You could easily use those for your sheriff vehicles. And then you have your uh, ambulance. So you could also rename your ambulance sirens. So at the way this is, you have basically right here. This is your main LSPD siren. And then right here you got your fire truck siren. I think this one's pretty obvious because it all says fire truck. So LSPD, fire truck, police four, highway patrol, does not work, uh, sheriff if you want, and ambulance. So that's what they are. I will post this down in the description, um, but make sure you have the dead air. You ha I cannot stress that. You have to have the dead air. Without the dead air, you will mute your entire uh, vehicle's AWC file, hands down, without a doubt. I guarantee it. So make sure you get dead air. And if you have a problem where you put all those dead air files in and you get in the game and you hit your sirens and nothing happens, you're going to have to go in and do some more dead air because I guarantee you you're over that 16 megabytes or kilobytes or whatever the hell it is. Kilobytes. So hopefully that helps. Hopefully this will help you guys get all the sirens to your musics, your ears, your ears content. Hopefully this will uh, allow you to have um, better, better sirens and make you feel way better about your your sirens i went completely rogue there but uh um i will update these with the actual names i fix those for you file save i will post this in the description of the video when it comes out along with a link to uh the chp siren that i used the master Com b siren that i used the fire truck siren that i used and um the dead airspace uh file that i used i'll post all that in the description for you guys to find it uh Huge uh, thanks to Benzo for giving me the idea by saying that he didn't know how to change it, and then it dawned, and then I was like, "Yeah, no, you can change it." So that's where that came from. So huge shout out to him for that, and uh, that's gonna do it. So now you guys can go play with 15 different sirens and have fun. So I will see you guys in the next one. Don't forget, you guys are the best, and I'll see you in the next one. Take care, guys.